Good evening. Here are some of the headlines to look forward to regarding tomorrow the 12th of March 2024. This is tomorrow's news today. Starting with national news, bandits demand 40 trillion naira as ransom for 16 abducted Kaduna residents. Investigator tells court how Emefiele and nine officials approved multi-billion contracts to wife and CBN staff's companies. Akpabio inaugurates panel to probe 30 trillion naira ways and means secured under Buhari. Reopen land borders, allow importation of food, Abba Yusuf tells Tinumbu. Senior Staff Association of Nigerian Universities and the Non-Academic Staff Union declare a one-week warning strike over withheld salaries. Still on the 4.8 billion naira fraud, court fixes April 15 for further hearing on Kletos Ibeto's case. Or your ban single-use plastics and styrofoam. Eight terrorists have been killed as troops raid hideouts in Bono. Plato clamps down on owners of illegal structures and arrests 17 persons. On to business news, CBN lacks liquidity to support Naira as derivative deals overwhelm FX reserves, says Economics Intelligence Unit. Investors salivate as 96.6 million units of GTCO shares traded in a single day. In tech news, Telegram hits 900 million users and years profitability as founder Mo's IPO. In international news, UK bans international health and care workers from bringing dependents. Escalating gang violence cripples Haiti as embassies airlift staff. Lastly, in sport news, Ivory Coast Cup of Nations hero Hala to miss next two friendlies. Australian Rugby League star has been banned eight games over racist slaw. Get details of these news and more on our website at guardian.ng or pick up a copy of our newspaper from a newsstand closest to you. Don't forget to follow us at Guardian Nigeria on all our social media platforms. I'm Ifunaya Wachiku for Guardian TV. Good night.